Oh, it's you first. So, I mean, same thing as last week. Like, yeah. You win in Houston and a regulation loss here. I mean, is there any anything you can draw from that? Well, I mean, you know, bottom line, we give up a goal on the first shift. Um, you know, veteran guys are leaders. We make a mistake. We don't cover the guy in the slot. Uh, we get a lead, then we take a bad penalty to give him a five on three, which we can't do. Um, that team's dangerous enough. They're going to score. And on the third goal, the two veteran guys leave the front of the net and leave a guy walking right down the slot. Um, you know, our best players have got to be our best players, and right now they're not. Um, you know, our young kids are playing hard. You know, everybody's working hard, but uh, you got to think the game. And when you make those mistakes in this league, that, that's what's going to happen. Can you talk a little bit about the penalty trouble? I mean, you guys had a penalty 200 feet from your net, a couple that seemed kind of unnecessary. Yeah, uh, bottom line, though, I'm sure some of the guys are frustrated, but uh, you know, at the crucial moments of a game, you can't take them, whether it's a, a tripping penalty, and a, I've always said self-discipline is the key. you got to know what you can and can't do. Um, you know, The penalty uh, to give them the five on three was the game changer. You got a two to one lead, and now they tied it two two, and um, you know, you're only going to kill off so many penalties. So you know, uh, there's got to be a little bit of uh, Accountability by the guys in that room of uh, you know you know the rules you know what you can and can't do and it's a commitment. Really, you had a lot of opportunities in the end of the game, coach. When you pull, when you pull the last two two and a half minutes, you had some good shots and just good built in. But you see, well, we we we're, we're missing a lot of opportunities. Pucks are bouncing even when we have open nets. We're shooting it wide. Pucks are bouncing just past us. If we're on one side, it's on the other. A little bit as a puck luck, but. You know, we kind of get what we deserve. If you're, uh, you know, if you're not totally committed every shift, uh, knowing what you got to do and uh, committed in the D zone, um, you're going to struggle. You know, we get a lot of shots. We work hard um, for our opportunities. But again, you need every all four lines going. And I thought, uh, you know, our young kids are playing real well. You know, the fourth line got a goal. Uh, Mike Hedden had a big goal there early to tie the game up. Uh, Glenny uh, playing well. Benner playing well. You know, so that's the bright side of it. There's, you know, you're developing kids, and uh, that's the upside. But. Uh, you know, it's got to be a total team effort. You got to have everybody going in the right direction. Would you say? I would say. Would you say there's a lot of energy, but maybe lack of focus at this point? I wouldn't say a lack of focus. I just think there's pressure on guys, and uh, you know, you've got to be able to read and react. You know, that third goal, two guys leave the front of the net to go uh, you know, away from the slot. You let a guy walk back down the slot. That's stuff that guys know. Um, you know, we we work on our D zone enough. Uh, we talk about it. You know, head of a swivel in our own zone, and you get caught the puck walking. And, in the back of your net. You know, I'm not going to blame Box on that one. We let a guy walk right down the slot, but uh, you guys have got to know better. It's just that simple. So how do you get over this hump? You just keep battling through it. You know, you can either uh, you know you can either feel sorry for yourself, or you come back on Monday and you work harder. We have two games in Charlotte. And, um, you know, still a long season, but uh, again, the commitment's got to be 100% for each and every guy, and uh, you know the willingness to learn and uh, you know the, the willingness to commit every single day. That's been the difference. We. We battle hard. You can see them working hard. We've been out shooting teams. Um, I think the penalty kill's been good. The power play, the one power play is going really good. The other one's struggling a little bit. But uh, again, it's a commitment that uh, you got to have all five guys working as hard as they can possibly work to have success. With the trip to Charlotte, are you going to get a chance to make it down to uh, the Atlanta area at all? I will have to go one day to work uh, to fix some stuff in my house uh, because I'm renting it out. So uh, yeah, you. I will try to make it down there for a day. Thank you. Thanks a lot.